So in the inter interest of continuity and everything else, I haven't touched Rust since the last video, just because I wanted to make sure that everything's consistent between. So the boxes are all exactly the same as they were before. There's nothing new. Everything is literally exactly where I left it, right down to the food that's in there and the stuff that's in the TC. So what we're gonna do today is literally pick up where we left off and we are gonna head from here. We are gonna go and check out the dome, I think. We're gonna see what's up there because there's a lock crate there. I'm not quite sure what the deal is with, with unlocking them. So we're gonna go and see what that is. And then we're gonna explore probably some train tunnels or or um or maybe water treatment we're going to pick another we'll pick another monument after there as well but dome and that lock crate is priority number one so let's get started now from what i've been told dome is um one of the more straightforward monuments i suppose but relatively speaking straightforward i think you need some parkour skills to get to the top from what i can gather um but I'm also told that it's scientist free, so it should just be a case of negotiating the jumps and the runs and everything to get to the top. I'm assuming this locked crate, whatever it is, is gonna be right at the top. So we'll see, we'll see what happens when we get there. There it is. What's the way up? I can't, how do you get? There must be something to climb up out here somewhere. Maybe up this pole up here pole whatever you want to call it is it up to walk up here? there we go no scientists or other people yet which is always a bonus are these ladders here because someone's already been here He's not going to get up, but it'd be nice if he did. Oh shit, he did. That's a helicopter somewhere as well. That makes me feel very anxious. I can't believe he stood up. That's pretty incredible. Let's get to a safe spot and then we can heal ourselves up. over there that's making me very anxious because I don't want to get up to the top just to get slapped by that thing oh comp is that a compound bro nice that'll do where's my because I didn't even <laughs> didn't even realize that I dropped my other one what a ridiculous human being eh I'm assuming this crate's going to be up here what is that? Supply signal. I don't know what a supply signal does. Oh, is that for the is that for the ammo crate drop things? Is that what that's for? Is that the crate? How do you? Fifteen minutes. So I have to hang out here for fifteen minutes for that to unlock. This best be worth it. Yes, I know. I took a rad suit off on top of dome where it's the most radioactive place arguably in the entire game i was not thinking straight and yes i am an idiot i don't want to die of radiation poisoning either how am i going to get around this i'm not this radiation is going to fucking kill me isn't it is as well. Or maybe maybe I'll be alright. The hell was it? Is that the helicopter shooting? Is that another one? That's another one. God look at that. I just survived that radiation. By one HP. But they have dropped another crate right next to me as well. Oh, has it crashed? Yeah, 
Crashed again. Great. If this drops me back in on top of dome with all the same stuff and those crates still unlocking, I will be absolutely amazed. I don't even know what's in those crates, to be honest, though. I'm assuming some kind of weapon. <gasps> oh my god, it has. It's put me back up here. Come on. How long have I got? Two minutes. Come on, son. Six, is that six minutes on that one? Yeah. I've got to be so careful getting out of here. One health point. If it hadn't crashed, I would have run down and tried to find something to heal up with or found some food or something, but I don't really want to leave both of these while while they're unlocking in case someone else comes and steals them. I mean, I'm assuming that having two next to each other like this is a rarity in itself, but get rid of some of this shite as well. But Sod's Law says I'm going to wait here for the entirety of this and then that's got 43 seconds. In 50 seconds, someone's going to turn up and shoot me in the face. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Give me something good. What's this? Guns. Oh, okay. Oh, there's an AK. Okay, okay. I'm not mad at that. I'm not mad at that one bit. What else we got? Some HQM. Bullets. Rifle ammo. Rifle ammo. That's not bad. I'm not going to sniff at that. How long has this other one got on it? Three minutes. Okay. Back to the old waiting game. Is there enough one of these crates anywhere or is it just here? That's no, just here, isn't it? Oh no, there's one at the large oil rig as well. I'm not venturing out there yet. I'm not that brave. Cargo ship's got some on it as well. And that oil rig as well. Oh, so there's two oil rigs. Okay. I hope I can make it back without dying. I don't know if I want... I want to see what's in these other crates... In this other crate before I start picking stuff up out of these. You know? I feel, well, I don't know how much stuff is normally in these. But I don't want to fill myself up on stuff that's no good if, if I've got decent stuff in here, you know? Priority number one... I can always come back for other crates. Priority number one for me right now has got to be, I suppose, getting this stuff back. And... Here we go. What we got? Another gun. What's that? A counter. Right, well, HQM. Another one of them. Take this stuff anyway. Um, and then we can come back. Let me... Yeah. I can come back for them. I'm happy to come back for them. I just... I want to get these guns home. And I want to do it before I die because I don't want to end up accidentally falling off something and ruining all of this. So let's just get these back and then we'll go from there. I'm scared and nervous that something bad's gonna happen. Oh no! 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 Oh, no! Ah! Oh, ah! Oh, all that time, all that time. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get back in there, back there in time either. Oh, that's so annoying. Has he just been waiting there? Has that man just been waiting there for me to turn up? Oh, I'm so annoyed about that. Had that supply signal in it as well. Right, where is he? Or she? Whoever it is. Was that me there? Oh, shit. I can't believe I got it all back. Where's that horse? Come on, horsey, let's get out of here. Let's get this stuff back before whoever that idiot was turns up again. Cool, that was a stroke of luck. I can't believe that's happened. Let's go. What an insane stroke of luck, eh? If I was that person that was there, I would have legged it down. You have to assume that if you bump into someone in a monument where they know there was a lock crate, that that person's unlocked it, let alone that there was two. Oh, fuck off, bear. Fuck off. I'm not getting killed by a bear now. Oh. And I've got a minute left on a bag timer before I can get back to it. Jesus Christ. God, this game can be infuriating, man. I can still have that bear plodding around as well. It's never a good sign, is it? Right, let's go. Let's see what's happening. Come on. If I take anything else, I'm not going to be able to carry everything else that's already there. Oh, I'm not far. Oh, I wasn't far away either. Where was I? There I am. I can't believe I was that close to my base. Right, let's get in. Right, I got a bloody AK and I got it all the way home. What are the chances of that happening? I've dropped another gun though, I think. The stuff that I want, let's put that on. Um. Oh, 
Where did it go? That was too close for comfort. And I left my front door open. Idiot. Um, what do I need? Right, so, got everything down. Let's take arrows, keep the bag, take that and that. I don't know what they do, but I'm assuming they're gonna do something, so I'm gonna keep hold of them. Those pipes come in handy for building DBs. I'm gonna have to work out where the best place to do this supply signal is as well. I don't know what the crack is with that, because I'm assuming the second that the smoke starts going up for that, it's like a beacon of like, right, come and kill me now, please. Let's take some of this and we'll go to Outpost and unlock some shit. Is there anything else that needs recycling while I'm here? I might need to go check out the sea at some point as well, work out what's going on with all this diving gear. Um, anything else that needs recycling? It's starting to get dark now as well, isn't it? That's a crazy way to start off your day, isn't it, really, I suppose? Two locked crates. Died to a person that then didn't pick up my stuff. Went back and got it. Died to a bear. Still didn't lose my stuff. This game's crazy, man. Right, let's let's chuck some of this stuff in there. I'm sure this stuff could come in handy, but I just I'm not at the point where I, I want to start getting ahead of myself with computer tables and counters. I don't know what they do, so I'm just I'm going to stick to the basics for the time being. I think that's the more sensible way of doing it. Let's go work our way down this tech tree a little bit so we're not running around with nearly a thousand scrap on us. Right, I want to get down to... Right, there's a DB down there. What else have we got though? Axes and hatchets will come in handy. So let's let's unlock those because it's the same price to research them as it is to unlock them. Um, think. How much is that to unlock? 75. I've got one of those on me. Let me just see. 75 to unlock it. 75, yes, that's the same. 737 left, right, so. Um, what's that? Salvage sword. Is this, all, this is all stuff for outside, isn't it? Rugs, sandbags, bear traps. I don't think I'm going to need any of that stuff. Gloves and stuff, that's all stuff you come across pretty easily. I'm not fussed about planter boxes and fridges and stuff uh, not now anyway it's like, right so yeah so let's go down the weapons one see how far down we can get I'd like to get if I can to the shotgun trap boom that'll do for that what do I need to build one of those actually 500 wood 250 metal frags two gears two ropes I think I've got all that at the base what do I need to build one of them 100 wood 75 metal, 100 wood 125 metal. So the only thing that's missing from there is wood. So if I go and get some wood now, I can make a, I can make a hatchet. Do you know what? I think I might just take this stuff back first. Cannot see a thing. It is so dark. I don't know where my base is. There is a bear right there. Oh, that was a horse. That means my base must be... Is that it? Yes. That's a pretty successful morning then. Right, now let's drop these off. I don't want I'm gonna get some wood and stuff. I'm going to wait for morning, actually. I'll have a sort out in these boxes while I'm waiting for the morning. Alright, let's get some wood and stuff. pick up anywhere. There's someone up there. I've got a real bad feeling he's going to try and kill me.
Oh. Yep, I was right. At least he's disappeared. Of course it's possible that in a server that only has five people on it, I bump into the one person that enjoys mercilessly killing people though. That, that tracks. Oh, what? No, not again. Oh, fuck off, bruv. What is the point? Yo, 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 dude, 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 chill, 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 man, chill, I've got nothing on me, I've got nothing on me, you're an... <sighs> right, I don't understand the point in killing someone that doesn't have anything, like, he killed me 30 seconds ago, I clearly haven't got anything of any worth, people are idiots, people are the fucking worst on this game. Here he comes again. Dr. Dickhead. Why? I've got nothing. I... This game is the worst. Right. Let's try respawning somewhere else. Just get, just let him get it out of his system, whatever it is that he's doing. Where am I? Up by water treatment. Now, water treatment, I know, like satellite dish, is hella radioactive so I'm not going to go near that where's my yeah so I've got a long way to get back to my base maybe we can just go on a little go on a little adventure for a few minutes let that twat get it all out of his system I mean this is probably not the best use of my time or energy but I'm going to need some components. Now I've unlocked all that stuff, I'm going to need some components. And they've got to come from somewhere. And if Jesus, or whatever his name is, is up there being an idiot, just leave him to it. Let him let him wreck people that have literally got nothing on them. And I'll see what's around it. Oh my god, there's a pig and a bear. Yeah, they're fighting. I'm going to get out of here while they're fighting each other. Has he, he re dude wrecked my bag? Right, I need I need wooden stone. Someone's fighting. Too close to outpost to put a bag down. I remember right, don't those shelves come in handy for, um, can you stack boxes on them? I might be wrong. Stone mission accomplished. There's a lot of this stuff that I'm just not ready to use yet, so I'll get rid of anything that's not a. 
I have to check these because last time I was here someone left a load of cloth in one and then someone left a load of scrap in one as well. Um, right, let's get rid of the stuff that I'm not going to use. Or something that anything that can't be turned into a component. Oh, we've got 143. I don't know if that's enough. What do I need for a 175? Never mind. Right, well, hopefully now Captain Kill Everyone that was up the top has had enough and moved on to other things. Because I want to go back and get some stuff and then have a look at another monument, maybe, I think. That's a large base there. I didn't notice, I've never noticed that one before. Is this thing crashed again? It's twice today that's crashed. <sighs> Third time lucky, eh? Why is it so laggy all of a sudden? What's going on here? That's three times it's crashed in less than an hour. So I'm going to leave this for a little while and then I'm going to come back to it because otherwise I'm going to end up losing my temple with it. Right. Right. So, now that everything has hopefully stopped crashing, I suppose we should go and have a look at another monument. Our launch site, from what I can gather, is quite intense, so I'm going to skip that one. We did the military base, I did the dome this morning. What, do you know what? I could go back to the dome because there was a bunch of stuff there that I didn't get. There was a load of boxes there that I didn't get. So we could do the dome and then maybe hit train yard afterwards. That seems like a good start, doesn't it? And I need some wood as well. Fuck's sake. Why? <sighs> this game's so annoying sometimes. Thank you. Full health completely out the window. That's annoying. I don't understand the point of killing people when they don't have anything on them. Is it just a way to ruin someone's day? I've got to assume it is, because I don't see any other reason for doing it. There is no point in killing me if I've got nothing on me. Right. Got a bow. Got some arrows. Let's head back to the dome and see what's going on up that way. But I've got to beware that there's a dude up here that's just murking everyone I don't want to end up running into him I think the cool thing about the dome so far is not only is there no scientists there it's a relatively straightforward monument to get through but you don't need a card to get everything out of it as well it's, uh, it's a pretty it's a pretty self-contained thing do you know what I mean it's a good starting spot for me to get used to like the the running and the jumping. Cause now I have to go back and heal up again. Great. What's this? Someone is raiding hard over there, whoever that is. Right. 
100 HP. Let's get rid of these bottles when we get out. 100 HP. I've got a couple guns out. I'm going to take a gun with me just in case as well, I suppose. I've got some bandages. I've got full HP and food and everything else. Let's go see if we can work out what's happening at the rest of Dome without getting blown to bits. Start at the top and work our way down, I suppose. Seems like the most sensible way, doesn't it? Seeing as all those um, ammo crates and stuff were at the top before. Recycler here. <clears throat> I don't know if there's a. I've, I haven't seen one, but then again, I haven't really been looking. There might be. Is there a recycler here? I don't know, we'll have a look when we get back. There's definitely not one up here, so we'll have a look when we get back to the bottom. What's that? A wind turbine. I don't know what I can do with that, if anything. someone for a minute then. I'm sure. I'm absolutely sure I can hear someone else running around. So they're just barrels, aren't they? I'm not that fussed about barrels. There's never anything exciting in them. Well, not enough to take me sort of off track. Where am I going? Can't see anyone knocking around. Shit. Oh. That was lucky. If there was if there was a recycler here, I'd worry more about the about the barrels. I've got nothing to I've got nothing to gain from barrels really, like right now. Because there's barrels everywhere. But saying that, is it gonna have a load of sort of we didn't get a lot. But we got something off I wasn't sure what was gonna be in those what was going to be in those green crates at the top so I wanted to check them out it's not the best, not the worst it's some stuff that will recycle into something that's a bit more useful so can't argue with that can I? try and get back to um, try and get back to the outpost recycle some of it up and then we'll go and have a look what's in the train yard oh shit Never make that jump. <laughs> uh, right, so what's that? Phone can go, those can go. I've got no use for a wind turbine, I don't even know what it does. Um, uh, springs, I think, come in useful. Semi automatic bodies are going to come in useful. That is for tarp or turn into cloth. Yeah, there we go. We get some bandages out of that. It's not a little bad run, is it? I suppose. Let's go. I want to see if I can make a shotgun trap for the base and if I can what parts I need to make it. I need two gears. Oh I've only got one. That's a pain. That is right in it. Oh no I've got two. So what else do I need? Two gears, two oh rope, metal frags, wood. Okay. Right, so I don't have enough stuff to make a shotgun trap, but we're getting there. Um do I have enough stuff to make a DV? 175 metal frags. 175, what have I got? 110, right, okay. Well, let's go and get some more metal frags from the base, and then we can make a DB, and then we can go to the train yard and see what's cracking in there. Is train yard best? What's it's closest, isn't it, I suppose? Yeah. I can hear some. Can I hear someone? Can I hear someone? God, I hope not. I think I should probably wait till morning before running out again. Seems like the sensible thing to do, doesn't it? What I am going to do is... Where's that hammer gone? Seeing as I've got a load of HQM, I've got like 200, 
It takes 13 to upgrade it. I'm going to upgrade this roof. What do I need for two metal pipes, 175? Let's wait for morning and we'll go and see what's going on at train yard. So everyone in the comments before was telling me when I did um, the abandoned military base was to check out the subway and to check out the ocean monuments as well. Which I think, I mean I'm not going to try and take an oil rig by myself and I'm certainly not going to get involved with a cargo ship or anything like that but I'm, I could go to fishing village and get a boat a little bit later. Let's do train yard first. Here we go. Sun's starting to come up. Let's go to let's go to the outpost and make some DB. Is this just frozen again? Are you kidding me? No. Right, okay. Right, train yard. So I have no idea what to expect here. And I'm probably vastly underprepared for it. Let's see what happens. I know there's some scientists here, I just don't know how many or where they are. So we start with this start with this tower over here. Oh, headshot. Oh! Two in a row, I've never done that. Oh, oh. Got him. Fucking got him. Three headshots, that's never happened and will probably never happen again. Now, if, this is, if there's another guy up here, it's going to be close. So we'll keep this DB out because that's more of a close range weapon in it don't know what that does right so what's in this building over here then Is there nothing up here? Right, next building or room. That's the room I was just in. Get up there, you fucking prick. I don't know what these fuses and stuff do. I literally have no idea what I'm doing or where I'm going. I'm just <laughs> just turning shit on. But it looks like someone was here not long before me, whatever his name is, and he got marked. Right, so there's nothing up here. What about up here? Oh, I need a blue card for that. Shit. This helicopter to draw any attention to me. Right, so you need a blue card to get into this room here. That's annoying. If I'd have known, what? Oh no, that's a, oh, that's a green card room. What happens if you go in here? Have I got a green card? Yeah, I have. So that's the main room. Oh, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? 
Look at that. Where is it? Oh, is there? That was terrible. Come on. Oh, stop moving. Got him. Hit him twice. Hit him again. Killed him. That was not my finest moment, but... cover it but there wasn't bloody plant pot come on stand up <sighs> yes stood up I just can't believe he stood up have I got any cloth no and I've got nothing oh no I've got bandages the wrong buttons. Oh. There's no way he's getting up. No, not now. And the game's frozen again. What is going on? There we go. 30 second pause just to get shot in the face. Brilliant. Right. I need to go back and get my stuff then, don't I? Face does look pretty cool though, doesn't it? Right. Let's see if you can't get back in there and get my shit back. It's not even like I can finish the whole thing because I haven't got a blue card. It's this is just pure I can't I can't let them take my stuff and then get away with it. It's not on. Come on, where are you? That's one down. Is the other one still down? Oh, what the fuck? What was that gun? My, my body from before is in that room. Can I get in and get my stuff? I didn't think you could actually, like, reason with people in this game. That's kind of cool. Um, what am I looking for? Bandages. Right, well, if he's here, I don't want nothing to do with it. I'm going to let him clean up, and I'm going to get the F train out of here. Right. 
Right, well, the fact that I shot a guy in the face three times is kind of a success. But I can't claim the rest of that as success. Dude's in there, dressed in whatever the hell he's dressed in, marking people left, right and centre. I ain't about to get in a fight with him about that. I'm not at that level. So I'm not really sure what to do now. I got my DB back. That was one of the things I was most sort of concerned about. Right, furnace is running. I've put everything away that I can. These all four of these boxes now are full, so I need to try and work out what to do with them. I might get someone to come. I might try and get someone to come help me out for a little bit. Show me what's what. What's best to do with with a lot of this stuff because I know it's useful, but I don't necessarily know what for. So maybe when I come back a little bit later, I'll try and bring someone back with me to show me what's cracking with all this stuff. Um, right, that's going to do me for now. I'll see you later.